was not there. Well, I was there for the right reasons for me, okay. which were to get out of my hometown a little bit and spread my wings and have some fun. And I was, you know. But you, you had a singing career. You had an album out of it. Were you, were you looking to, hey, maybe, maybe I can get some attention to my music Actually, career. you know, I didn't even think about that during The Bachelorette because I didn't know what The Bachelorette was, frankly. It wasn't until after The Bachelor stuff when my record label all of a sudden was like, yeah, we haven't put this out in a while. Let's put this album back out. <laughs> you know, and, yeah, literally have yeah, and they start out. calling, and you're like, oh, because I went on The Bachelor. Well, my mindset of going on The Bachelor was I'm going to have a great time, and hopefully, you never know, but this kind of weird, you know, concoction of things, maybe I will meet somebody I would never meet otherwise. And so you went, I went into The Bachelor with that mindset, and, you know, it was one of those things where it was a blast. You never go on dates where you're on hot air balloons or private jets going That's to Belize true. and on all these different things, and it was really, really fun, but also really difficult to obviously keep the relationship together. But did so. it help your career afterwards? Well, un uh, undoubtedly, yeah. I mean, it was one of those things where, um, well, Oprah actually, you know, from my what I went through was she put me to be her man on the street for a little while, and I got to do a bunch of fun stuff with her. And oh, wow. if Oprah says you're okay, everyone else says you're okay too. Exactly. So I got lucky. Wow. But uh, but yeah, it's getting lucky. It did. When you go to that fantasy <laughs> suite, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the fantasy suite. Look at Sam. Sam's Ask right the real <laughs> question. He's right I'll answer for you this way. I'm gonna answer for you this way. If you didn't see it on TV. It didn't happen. Oh, right. <laughs> That's all I got. That's all I know. Uh, really? Yeah. Is that true, or are you uh, just saying that? I, I, I'm sorry. It's my earpiece is Bob's putting out a DVD <laughs> called Behind the Bachelor. <laughs> I think to make, the, to make The Bachelor more interesting, they should put girls and guys. I think that, would, especially for this one, because I think he might choose the guy. Oh. <laughs> I was just going to say, does he like girls? Does he like girls? I, you know, I, I, I would say that he probably does. That's one of my I mean, first questions, you know, I think, I think they, you know, they, they don't... They don't necessarily uh, say that in the rules that you have to pick anybody. And this guy I think this guy's going to give Chris Harrison a rose. Oh. I'm just saying. I'm just It might happen. I would. <laughs>